Hello everyone, today I'm going to be talking about abortion and why it should be illegal. If you're going with the idea of abortion, then you're basically allowing the act of murder. Women can do anything with their body, but it should still be a crime for the abortion of a child. More females should appreciate what they have created, because while they are aborting a baby, many other women are crying because the loss of theirs, or some just can't have any. It's really heartbreaking to see the acts that women do and don't care or think about. Abortion should be illegal because abortion is murder. Fetuses can feel pain during their abortion procedure and abortion can cause physical damage. The act of abortion should be illegal because no argument can compare with the decision of, of another human being to help us get a better understanding of why abortion is murder. Let's discuss how and why. Women are known for being life givers, but nowadays it's reversed because of the, because of the act of abortion. In about five weeks, a fetus can have a heartbeat. Women are known for being life givers, but nowadays it's reversed because the act of abortion. In about five weeks, a fetus can have a heartbeat. Some women don't even know that they are pregnant at this time. The first two things to develop in a baby are the heart and the brain. And once a baby has a heartbeat, then that means that they are alive and have life. Killing the fetus will be murder. There are many factors that contribute to the emotional disorders of women who did the act of abortion. Abortion is linked to the after effects of women smoking, drinking, and having major emotional depression because of the guilt that they feel. Studies show that most countries that ban the act of abortion, like Iran, have shown, shown crazy results of women being in less depression, depressive situations than women who are in countries that haven't banned it. There are many factors that contribute to the emotional disorders of women who did the act of abortion. Abortion is linked to to the after effects of women smoking, drinking, and having major depression, emotional depression because of the guilt that they feel. Studies show that most countries that ban the act of abortion, like Iran, have shown the crazy results of women being in less depression situations than women who are in countries that haven't banned it. Women should not use an abortion as a form of contraption. Some women nowadays use abortion for the use of alternative versions of contraptions. The reason for this is poor couple communications. There are many factors that contribute to the emotional disorders of women who did the act of abortion. Abortion is linked to, to the after effects of women smoking, drinking, and having major depression, emotional depression because of the guilt that they feel. Studies show that most countries that ban the act of abortion like Iran have shown the crazy results of women being in less depression situations than women who are in countries that haven't banned it. Women, women should not use an abortion as a form of contraption. Some women nowadays use abortion for the use of alternative, an alternative version of contraption. The reason for this is poor couple communication skills lacking lack of planning lack of methods and for their own selfish pleasures for unprotected sex women choose abortion as the easiest route instead of handling their responsibilities when a woman has an abortion she is not thinking about the child but only about herself abortion rights supporters frame that this argument is a woman's powers issue Yes, women have the right to do what they want with their own body. But if it involves taking another life that hasn't lived yet, then it's selfish. Some people may believe that a fetus is just a fetus and not a child. But what makes that less important than any other child out there? Any life is better than no life. Yes, having a baby may be tiring and more expensive, but in the end, it is unimaginably rewarding. The women that constantly complain about work or school are just making excuses. Rape should also be a reason. Rape should also not be a reason that a child should be aborted. If a woman was ever in a process where a baby was not intended, then adoption is always the best decision. The mother or the child doesn't need to go through any bad situations. There is no need to involve violence with death. 
women choose abortion because they feel like it's the most easiest solution to a messy and expensive situation. They choose abortion because they feel like it's the best decision for themselves while being selfish to another life. While a life is being lost, there will still be no regard for it. Yes, women have the right to do what they want with their own body, but if it involves taking another life that hasn't lived yet, then it's selfish. Some people may believe that a fetus is just a fetus and not a child, but what makes that less important than any other child out there? Any life is better than no life. Yes, having a baby may be tiring and more expensive, but in the end, it is unimaginably rewarding. The women that constantly complain about work or school are just making excuses. Rape should also be a reason. Rape should also not be a reason that a child should be aborted. If a woman was ever in a process where a baby was not intended, then adoption is always the best decision. The mother or the child doesn't need to go through any bad situations. There is no need to involve violence with death. Women choose abortion because they feel like it's the most easiest solution to a messy and expensive situation. They choose abortion because they feel like it's the best decision for themselves while being selfish to another life. While a life is being lost, there will still be no regard for it. After having an abortion, women often suffer from depression because of regret. Not only that, but abortions create a risk of having a, a miscarriage or pelvic inflammation disease in the future. Abortions aren't helping your life, they're ruining it. All of this can be avoided by our bodies that weren't made to have abortions. You are taking the life of a human being when you have an abortion. The fetus has a heartbeat five weeks after the mother last period and the fetus heart starts pumping blood throughout its body at six weeks. People say abortions is not killing an actual living being, but that's false. The time period recommended to have a safe abortion is 10 weeks. By this time, the baby is already active, its teeth and fingernails are growing in, it can start making facial expressions, and even have the ability to have hiccups. Please tell me how that isn't a human being. The Declaration of Independence says that all men are created equal, that they are endowed by the Creator with certain unalienable rights, that among these are life, liberty, and pursuit of happiness. But by having an abortion, you are taking the baby's right of life and happiness. Yes, women have the right to do what they want with their own body. But if it involves taking another life that hasn't lived yet, then it's selfish. Some people may believe that a fetus is just a fetus and not a child. But what makes that less important than any other child out there? Any life is better than no life. Yes, having a baby may be tiring and more expensive. But in the end, it is unimaginably rewarding. The women that constantly complain about work or school are just making excuses. Rape should also be a reason. Rape should also not be a reason that a child should be aborted. If a woman was ever in a process where a baby was not intended, then adoption is always the best decision. The mother or the child doesn't need to go through any bad situations. There is no need to involve violence with death. Women choose abortion because they feel like it's the most easiest solution to a messy and expensive situation. They choose abortion because they feel like it's the best decision for themselves while being selfish to another life. While a life is being lost, there will still be no regard. Abortion can and should be stopped. It's not right nor human to kill a human being because you can't or don't want to take care of it. I understand women are scared or just don't have the time to take care of a child, but adoption is always a choice. Abortions change pe can change a woman's mood forever and not always for the best. The child has rights by aborting, you are taking the baby's right of life. Effects and you taking the baby's right of life away is basically killing and is never right under any circumstance. Therefore, abortion should be illegal. And because sexually abused women do not desire for guardianship of the child, females do not want their body to be unfit because of pregnancy 
or it was a careless mistake that could have been prevented with birth control or any other prevention method. Many women have non-essential abortions. One question, questionable example of this is in China. They kill fetuses if the sonogram proves the unborn child to be a female. Abortion should be illegal because it is unjust and purposely slaughtered to the unborn human being. In most beliefs, people consider abortions to be unethical and murder to the unborn child.